Assassin's Creed 2 is a game rated M by the ESRB. Hello everyone and welcome back to more Assassin's Creed 2. Today, we're going to save Lorenzo. Wolves in cheap clothing prevent the conspirators from attacking the Medici family. Except. Locate Francesco de Pazzi. By going the exact other direction. Let's go. Francesco! Francesco! There's Lorenzo and his wife. There's Giuliano, Lorenzo's brother. Where is Francesco? There he is. I'm just drunk. Defend Francesca or Lorenzo. Kill Francesca. Kill. Kill. La borsa. Tua madre non può aiutare. Kill. Hey. Ow. Oh. It's nothing, but the man who did this to you has to pay. Ah, not now. I need help first. To my home. Uh, people I trust. Uh, can you? Ah. Stay close. Let's go. I'm losing a lot of blood. Hang on, signore. I'm moving as fast as I can. Just keep moving, just keep moving. Well, just go the I'll kill him. We can kill some of them. I'll wipe his entire family from the city. They'll be alright! There we go. Rietatevi, signore. Conserve your energy, or I'll be delivering a corpse. You're almost there now. There. There. And there. This way. <laughs> kill another guy. <laughs> We're just gonna kill all of these people. Don't worry, Lorenzo. I'm very good at what I do. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. I didn't mean to get away of you. Let me, let me try again. Let me, let me try again. There we go. Much better. <laughs> I've not forgotten how to wait. Hello. Can you can you defend? I had hope. Here we go. Ha! I'm more than capable of Oh. Those guys. 
Like a mother clucker. This way. Lorenzo has been wounded. Aprite la porta. What's the password? Poliziano, open the maledetta porta. Wait a trice, Gratis. Come in, quickly. The city is at war. Hurry. Wait. I am in your debt. Tell me, why did you help me? You are not the only one who lost a brother to the Pazzi. My name is Ezio Auditore. Ah. Your Giovanni's son. Your father was a good man. He understood honor, loyalty. The Pazzi thugs are storming the Palazzo della Signoria. We cannot hold them off much longer. No. If they get inside, they'll murder our supporters and put their own devils in power. Then my survival would mean nothing. I have to... Francesco de Pazzi. Help save our city, Auditore. Kill him. I always loved that facial animation. Kill him, and then where? I just love him. Signori, I saw Francesco lead a battalion around the back of the Palazzo della Signoria. I fear he may be seeking another way in. Go, before it's too late. Do what you can! Farewell, Francesco. Find and kill Francesco de Pazzi. Francesco de Pazzi. Brought up as a noble in a city captivated by the newly rich Medici family, Francesco was taught to hate the middle class and its social climbers. Dismayed, he watched as the Medici bank eclipsed his own and centuries of influence over the Florentine government slipped away. It looks like the Spaniard offered him a solution. Rather than compete in something as dirty as banking, Francesco only had to do one thing for the Templars, one thing to put the middle class in their place for good. Kill the Medici. Giovanni Auditore tried to stop Francesco by putting him in jail. But the Templars took care of that. Mm. Who is the villain? There you are. Oh! Oh, hello. I hope you guys are, like, actual villains and not just, uh, Medici guards, because that would really suck. Okay, you guys look like you're wearing red and not... not yellow. So that's good. Ooh, let's take down this while we're here. <laughs> Whee! Oh, that's weird. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I forgot you need to be actually within, like, one feet of it. My bad. I really worried that was a shadow for a second. Okay, we have to get all the way over there. That's right. Climb. Over here. Oh. A treasure chest. Money is always helpful. There, okay. You again? Why aren't you dead? Men, slide! 
Watch our head! Help out a little bit. Oh! those guys now we need to get up here first Guys, I want to get as much stuff as I can. <laughs> Pat your body just a little bit. Tap, tap, tap. I'm just touching your butt. Don't worry about it. It's very firm. Thank you. coming. It's just us now. Maledetto che il diavolo ti porti! Stavi lontano! I am gonna kill you. It's just a matter of when. You will die. It will be by my hand. <laughs> No, can, can you? Okay, give me one second. <laughs> Sometimes it works in amazing ways, this now game. Firenze will judge you for what you've done. It's over. It's all over. Meglio essere felici in questa vita e aspirare a esserlo nella prossima. Requiescat in pace. Libertà! 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 Popolo e libertà! 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 
Francesco. Farewell, Francesco. Memory synced, sequence four complete. Look at Fiorentina, 1478. <sighs> Back where the game started. Back when we first encountered Ezio and Vieri. When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself drifting down and into darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. I am sorry I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. They attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. Hey, Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei, Archbishop Francesco Salviati, Stefano da Bagnone, and Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene, I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait, before you go. A codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco Di Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity, as did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. Pazzi conspirators. Jacopo di Pazzi, the money. This guy was the head of the Pazzi family, and he ran their banking business. An associate of Lorenzo de' Medici, he had nothing against him personally. So he hired four Templar hitmen to take care of the situation for him. Bernardo di Bandino Baroncelli. Brought up to hate the Medici family for the exile of his cousins, Baroncelli ran the numbers in the Pazzi bank by day and murdered for the Templars at night. It was Baroncelli who delivered the first blow. Stefano de Bagnone. Known for his cruelty, Bagnone was trained in Rome as a Templar butcher. It was Bagnone who stabbed Lorenzo de' Medici in the back. Antonio Maffei. Witness to the sacking of Volterra by Florentine mercenaries, Maffei blamed Lorenzo. He joined the Templars to seek revenge. It was Maffei who slashed Lorenzo's neck. Archbishop Francesco Salviati. Convinced he would be the next Archbishop of Florence, Salviati was enraged when Lorenzo stood in his way. But the Templars were there to heal his wounds. It was Salviati who marched their troops into the city. So those are the four conspirators of his. And now... We have to go talk to a good old buddy.
fast travel. <laughs> but we can't actually fast travel. So let's go talk to uh, our good friend. I've marked the Palazzo Medici on your map. In order to achieve 100% sync with Ezio's life, you should go explore. Thanks, Rebecca. Palazzo de Medici. Seven hundred bucks in my chest. Yeah. Carne, carne fresca. Come, amici, as fresh cheese curds and rosemary pasta. Ezio, thank God you're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi, is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city is safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design. For delivering poison. Can you build it? See, it won't take very long. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing the. It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. I love that he trusts them so much that he's just like, I'm gonna give it to you. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. Poison? From a doctor? In high enough doses, that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. I love their relationship. It is the best ever. <laughs> A blade with bite. Codex page deciphered. Hidden blade upgraded. Contact the poison blade because I need to go berserk. See, I like how this one only uses one, but this one uses the two. Oh! My bad. Well, now you're about to know how it works. Yeah, they start waving their arms all over the place. It becomes best when they actually have, like, a weapon in their hand. And, and then they... And then they die. And then everyone else goes about their daily business. Especially the monks who just saw a man die by no means. Anywho, start uh, heading towards Montregioni. Just gonna run all the way there. Run, run, run your boat all the way through Florence. Merrily, 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 life. I'm gonna kill. Monks. Guards. Eh. Harmonize my entire body. I meant that as little sexual as possible. The Santa Croce. Crotch. Santa Crotch. Oh, that's a guard. Probably shouldn't run right into them. I remember this. Just two years ago, I ran through these streets. With my bro oh, God. I'm so sorry, miss. 
I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean to. Shut the hell up. Or I'll break your face. And tell the other Italian stereotypical stereotypes. That's my best. Hello, monk. Montregioni. Yes, please. To Montregioni Villa. I accept. Uh. Thank you for taking me. Killed Francesco. And now... Peace has returned to Florence. For now. 700 bucks. Me likes, I'll takes. Ezio! <laughs> come in, come in! To what do we owe the honor? Hello, Mario. That's actually going to be it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please, please leave a like. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to make sure you guys get my videos first. And as always, stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy. I've been the Luka Gamer, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Good gaming.